out to um, all of my Scorpios out there. So please be sure to get my book at Amazon or BarnesandNoble.com. The link to that is in the description box below as usual. Comment on the video, like the video, subscribe to my YouTube channel, share the video. Um, so this is for Scorpios, right? Um, also, by the way, I also have a new service. Just bringing them back. I am selling uh, the Mayan calendars that I used to sell a few years ago, back in 2016. They're very good. Excuse me. They actually help link you up uh, to the days of the week. And they're pretty much more accurate than the regular calendar that most people use today. Um, they're pretty, they're cheap. They're only $25. You know what I mean? Uh, so if you like, if you're interested in that or any other one of my services, right, which is in the description box, as well as the prices, it's in the description box. So let's get into it for my Scorpios, right? Let's get into it. So the cards that I come up with for my Scorpios are the Two of Swords, Two of Cups, Six of Wands, the Knight of Swords, the Fool, the Eight of Pentacles, the Star card, the Knight of Cups, the Queen of Cups, and last but not least, we got the Six of Swords. Okay, so... Um, what I'm seeing here for you, Scorpios, right? No major arcana that represents Scorpio. There's only about what two major arcana. Um, you Scorpios are kind of nervous about getting into a relationship with somebody else. The Two of Swords is you not knowing how you should move with this particular person. So you're sitting back and waiting until you can gather more evidence on whether you should proceed or not, for whatever reason. Um, the Two of Cups and the Six of Swords represent this person, right? The relationship in this person. So if you can picture it, right? Because I'm going to show you all three cards. This is you. This is the interest between you and this person and this is them okay so you have the two of cups and the six of wands and the six of wands is um again you're not necessarily sure if this person is interested in you for the correct reasons and you have a right to question that right because you should <laughs> question that most definitely um to be perfectly honest with you scorpios i think every zodiac sign should question why exactly a person is interested in them especially today you know what i mean with so many people using and misusing so many other people and even attempting to i think that to be honest with you that's a very viable option to ask the question why so then the knight of swords represent here the knight of swords is about you Scorpios may even ask them directly, why is that? And the fool is about, so the fool is about you asking them that, right? So uh, Knight of Swords, you're unclear, right? You're unclear, uh, Six of Wands, you're unclear about them, you're unclear about why they're doing some of the things that they're doing. So the fool represents, you just ask them, why are you doing what you're doing? And the thing is that the Eight of Pentacles is about them pretty much <laughs> letting you know what's up. You know, they like, they they like, they supposedly said that they like you. Um, you're a per, some of them said, some of them said that they like you. Some of them said that, you know, they like the fact that you, you have your stuff together, but it doesn't necessarily mean that they like you. The star card and the Knight of Cups represents how this is a situation for a lot of you where the star and the and the uh, Knight of Cups is about how you um, Scorpios need to pay attention to these people, right? If you're going to mess with them. So you have two options. You can either choose to be like, eh, I'm not really messing with you at all and leave them alone, which is what 
the Queen of Cups and the Six of Swords um, is talking about, right? You thinking about it, right? Or you trying to do that, but not necessarily so. It means that you should wait, okay? Because the uh, Six of Swords is invoked incorrectly, okay? Or it's saying that you'll mess with this person, but... Um, okay, now I understand. The Six of Swords represents you trying to mess with this person. Okay, I get it now. I get it now. Yeah, I don't think you should because... If this person, if this person's intentions isn't necessarily clear, or if someone's intentions isn't clear to you, then it means that they're doing a pretty good job at hiding their hand, right? And if that's the case, then it means that you shouldn't want to be around that person because you can't trust them. And, um, you know, in one of my videos of stuff like this, future videos, um, I don't know. I may cover it. I may, I may not cover it. it. It's, it's a video. It's a video about manipulation and why I said that everybody eventually is going to have to stop manipulation and kind of cover manipulation to where I, I, you know, I show you how ridiculous all oh, the Zodiac signs, all of them, not just y'all, but I show, I show you. The zodiac signs or y'all how ridiculous manipulation is but um i don't necessarily know but uh let's clarify these six of swords right if i, 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 I okay i'll say this right to be fair if you scorpios participate and y'all uh let me know in the comment section that y'all want me to make that video right if a couple of y'all let me know it just can't be one person if a couple of y'all let me know that you want me to make that video, then I'll go ahead and make that video, right? But it has to be a few of you uh, Scorpios in the comment section letting me know, right? It can't just be one. So to clarify, the Six of Swords, and that's another thing too that I'm going to start doing. I'm going to start kind of um, clarifying what cards I'm going to uh, clarify beforehand and then shuffle after. I'm not going to shuffle before and then kind of randomly do that so you have the six of swords excuse me seven of swords to clarify it the devil right and then you have the knight of wands exactly these people don't like you for you they're just trying to uh get by because things are becoming a little bit more uncomfortable for them in their own life right separate from yours and these people don't want their lives to be uncomfortable so they're using you as some sort of backup plan or, or bailout package. So you Scorpios need to pay attention uh, for this, right? Don't trust them. So that's pretty much it. Comment on the video, like the video, subscribe. Peace, y'all.